Greetings to all you wonderful people out there. My name is Danifer Scott from Jamaica. I'm a gospel artist, music producer, audio engineer, mixing engineer, also live sound engineer, among other things. Now, I'm about to do a review for the first time ever. This review is about Studio One Five. It's a powerful DAW, wonderful, excellent DAW, meets all my needs as a producer, slash musician, engineer, etc., etc. Now, I believe Studio One have made a terrible mistake. How could they have missed such intricate feature? You know what? Too much long talking. Let's dive right into what I'm about to show you. Now, my problem is with the recall settings. There is one important element or one important option that's missing, and that's automation. The ability to recall your automation. Now, let me show you a demonstration exactly why automation option is needed. Presonus, please, I'm begging you, fix this in an update. I don't know if I miss something. If it's there and I, I'm not seeing it, but I look and I'm not seeing it. But if there's a way around it, please, somebody comment in the comments and let me know if you know a little more than I do. All right, let me jump over to the console create an automation and then I'll come back and explain exactly what I'm saying to you. Now look at the scenario, look at what happened when I go back to mix one. So in, in double tapping on scene one, I want you to observe uh, channel four that the analog delay is gonna disappear, right? As it should, because it wasn't there in scene one. Likewise, I expect the automation to disappear and revert back to its original state as it were in scene one. So let's go, scene one. Yes, you can see channel four, the delay effect or the plugging disappear, but the automation don't move. Now, this is what I'm saying, guys. Picture you going through a song and you do intricate technical automation, creating all kind of effects, you know, based on customer requests or your creativity. But you like it and the customer say, you know what, try this instead. And you don't want to lose the automation settings that you had. Therefore, you create a new scene. In that scene, you, you make some modification to your processing, to your mixing, right? Both using plugging, automation, because depending on what you're doing, you might need to do some automation as well. Even the very plugging itself, you might need to automate volume. Here's another example, guys. Look what happened when I decided to go back to mix one in the event where the customer said they prefer that. Now, say for example, I go back to mix one. This is what's gonna happen now, folks. Take a look. See, the analog delay disappears because it was not a part of scene one. But also what should disappear is the automation trail. That shouldn't be there. But watch what happened now. If I decide that, or the customer decide that, I prefer scene two. So let's go back to scene two. Recall scene two. Yes, the analog delay comes come back, right? But notice the automation. The automation was not recall. Why? There is no option to recall automation. I believe Studio One make a big mistake. It's missing the automation recall option please let's do some review about this particular subject matter and this is about education you know where we can strengthen each other bless up to you all my viewers subscribe like leave a comment and remember be kind <laughs> all right bless up see you in my next video